today is 420. Yeah. Hell yeah, bro. Yeah. You smoking a little bit or what? <laughs> Me? Yeah. Nah, just, you know. Come on. No, no. Dude, I slept like garbage last night. Yeah, bro. smoke weed then. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what it was. A little, <laughs> little blazing. Oh, man. I, it was one of those where you, like, you feel like you didn't sleep at all. Oh, Because oh, you're up best. so much. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, did I ever fall asleep? Did I actually fall asleep? Or? What's on your mind? Oh, numerous yeah. things at all times, right? I mean, I'm all, I'm a thinker, you know. It's racing. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yeah, but uh, and also just not the greatest speaker. That's all. Okay. There's that too. Menace, how you feeling, buddy? Good. Yeah. Very nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I is it still called little... getting baked? Like when uh, you're doing like edibles or whatever? Is it just when you smoke? Uh, getting baked? I don't know this. It's not the it's 60s anymore. It's a universal anymore. term. Yeah. 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 Menace you, have been working on is high. Have you ever gotten yeah. baked, Rave? Like, have you ever smoked it? No. No? Oh, really? Wow. You're I, missing out. I don't know how to inhale. You got to learn. <laughs> you got to get like one of those, uh, what do they know. call them, volcanoes or vaporizers? Oh, that, dude, those are crazy. Oh, yeah. oh just do a vape pen? It's a lot easier. A lot, a lot smoother, obviously. Our yeah. late friend, uh, Ralphie May, used to swear by that. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Comedian Ralphie May. Pretty Rest cool. Rest in peace. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that is pretty cool, huh? It is. I yeah. I had one. I was in a <laughs> I was in this Bruh. like really nice suite at the Ritz Carlton with some super rich guy, and he was having a little party, and he had one of those things, and um, we were just getting crazy high, and it's on a floor where there's an all you can eat like buffet or something like that going on to have like an open bar <laughs> and buffet, and I just killed that buffet. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> If you're just tuning in, Menace is uh, getting high today for 420. Mm-hmm. It's a tradition, really. It yep. is. And uh, so far, it's been seltzer. And have there been any actual uh, edibles the little, yet? The little tiny um, chocolates. Oh, little chocolates. Yeah. Yeah, because I remember he had those oh mints God. at one point. Remember? Yeah, he's slamming those little those 10 milligram yes. mints. And he, he eats those the way that people eat Tic Tacs. Yeah. yeah. They just open it up and kind of dump them. Like, yeah. Slammed them. Yeah, mm-hmm. like... Uh, like Beavis when he's Cornholio. <laughs> yeah, true. You know, just like, <laughs> and those chocolates <laughs> that you did one year. Downs yeah. them. You're supposed to eat like one. You did the whole box or something. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, well, the new Cumberland Borough Police Department in Pennsylvania has a 420 offer on the table today. Mm-hmm. They're going to give a free bag of Doritos to anyone who brings their pot in to have it tested today, which <laughs> seems too good to be true. There must be a catch. Oh, there is. How dumb. Recreational use is still illegal in Pennsylvania, so Where's it is a mm-hmm. trap. <laughs> they say, quote, for your troubles, you'll get a regular size bag of Doritos, but if someone wants to turn in their dealer, we'll give you a family size bag of Doritos. Whoa. Ha ha. What, <laughs> what an incentive. Yeah, this is like right by uh, Harrisburg. Squares. <laughs> there are some actual 420 food deals today, Menace. Sweet. Jack in the Box, they have brought back their Pineapple Express milkshake. Oh. Uh, Wingstop. <laughs> yeah. I like chicken. Yeah, I love chicken. Wingstop is selling hot box meals. Okay. With fries covered in a spicy cheese dust. Mm. Cheese dust? Yeah. Sounds good. <laughs> okay. Uh, Jimmy John's has a new Munchy Crusher sandwich, which I'm not exactly sure what comes on that. But uh, there's probably pot- munchy Crusher. Sounds like there's potato chips up on that. Yeah. Yeah. All yep. up on that. Uh, for those who have Del Taco available, they have eight tacos for t- uh, four dollars and twenty cents today. Jeez, let's Damn. do it. At Smash Burger, you can get four burgers for twenty dollars. Nah. Okay. Blaze Pizza yes. is letting people upgrade their high uh, to their high rise crust for Hell free. Yeah. Oh, sweet! <laughs> and then Fat Burger, uh-huh. they're selling their original Fat Burgers for four dollars and twenty cents, but. For those of you in L.A., Fat Burger is selling a new cannabis-infused ketchup rave. And it's oh, only yeah. available to a few weed dispensers. Like, oh. you're not going to be able to go on, like, Fat Burger and get, ask for, like, the, We're the, all over the this. cannabis ketchup. <laughs> well, we know all about yeah. this. Behind the scenes, Ray and I have been discussing. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. That okay. sounds dangerous. It does. It sounds real dangerous. So have you tried it? Not yet. But I have a friend who's holding some for me. A lot oh. of dipping. Who's holding yeah. Uh, Let's go. Grub is holding some. Oh, he's holding the ketchup. I know him Anibus too. If, if he, Did he give me some? Uh, I'll I'll give you a couple. Wow. I'll give you a couple. Now, hmm. what are, yeah, yeah Ravi's holding out on you. <laughs> yeah. So you talked about it. I have. Ravi procured it. Yeah. And or has it tell, set up and, and didn't, didn't mention tell, that part. Yeah. To you. That Excuse tracks. me. Yeah. We Sounds talked about, right. about it. It was a we. Yeah. It was a we. Uh, mm-hmm. Some new data shows the drop in legal weed prices will most likely continue through the end of the year, which is great news for stoners, bad news for weed companies. 
who, despite what you might think, aren't exactly making money hand over fist. Mm -hmm. There's just so much of it. Yeah. And little time in the day <laughs> to smoke <laughs> yeah. it. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah. Yeah, just not enough time. Yeah. Yep. But uh, weed outpacing cigarettes, even. You know? Mm, I'm good. surprised anybody smokes anymore. I think about that, too. Like, when you see people smoking cigarettes, you're like, still? It's, it's rare. Still... And I and I get it for, you know, guys like my dad's age or whatever. Different generation stuff. Oh, yeah. If you I know? hit 90, I'm I'm doing a carton a day. No, it's, it's not about, it's not about <laughs> oh, now you're old day. now. I think it was just, you know. Habit. But, yeah, you got into the habit way earlier. I mean, although we've known that cigarettes are super bad for yeah. you. But, again. Right. So is eating an entire, you know, carton of the Costco mini chocolate chip cookies in one oh, sitting. Yeah. Peanut butter pie. And, uh, yeah, but, yeah, or the peanut yeah. butter pie. My, my bigger from Costco. question is if you're younger, why haven't you switched, uh, switched to vaping? Oh, and, they're all vaping. But I, yeah. I still see people in their 20s with not as many, obviously. But. Yeah. But didn't they say we had some scientific studies that said that if you try to start smoking after 20 something, it's extremely hard to get addicted. So get started mm. early, kids. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Kevin Smith. Director, movie star, mm -hmm. Kevin Smith, he gave up weed, mm -hmm. which is crazy. He's yeah, like the poster boy for weed for the longest time. So I'm so why? disappointed in yeah, him. But, I mean, and he, and he's not saying that other people shouldn't do it. It was just right. like, it was a personal for choice he's not, yeah. you know, for him. There was a story I saw about this guy. Um, he started smoking his sophomore year of high school. And he said it was for anxiety. That's back when he had to make up. Remember making up excuses just so he could smoke weed? Yep. Yep. Like all these people going to weed docs going like, oh, I well. Go. Every, I, I can't sleep. Yeah, there was, there were so many like 19, 20-year-olds with like cataracts. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, yeah. going to the weed doc. Uh, yeah. I went to the weed doctor and I just said I had kidney stones. And they go, here, here you go. Here like you go. kidney yeah. stones is like an everyday thing. Yeah. Like it doesn't pass. Yeah. And then you just go to the weed doc and you go <laughs> like, oh, what are you here for? Uh, Well, I'm having this. And they go. Hmm, okay, well, what else? And you just you start like just naming things until you got to something. Oh, okay, well, Anxiety. I can help you with that. A buddy of mine, that was his experience at the weed doc. Yeah. Whatever he said when he went in, I forget what it was. It wasn't good enough mm. of an excuse. Since How? when? Yeah. Yeah, right. Your buddy's an idiot. With yeah. A strict weed the doctor. The weed doctor <laughs> is like a two minute thing. No, and this is. You I'm, go in. I can't mm. sleep. Here you go. Bye. <laughs> I know, yeah. but this was years ago. This is when it was like first to thing. It's the forefront. Oh. Yeah. Still. Still. Moronic. Bad. He must look like a cop or something. He must look like a narc. <laughs> yeah, narc, yeah, maybe. Yeah. He's got, he gives off narc vibe. Yeah, he, he has yeah. cop face. <laughs> yeah, that's, a, that's a dummy who's like, he wasn't ready. He was yeah. like, oh, I don't know. I, uh, uh, yeah, you uh, tell me. <laughs> well, this guy I was reading about, he's a uh, sophomore in high school and he starts smoking weed, had anxiety. And uh, he thought, you know, just weed, don't see the harm. So he went from, uh, you know, just smoking it to dabs. Nice. Hell yeah, dabs. Oh, damn, that's hardcore. He was uh, <laughs> then smoking every day from morning until night. Two years later, apparently he develops cannabis-induced psychosis is what they call it, a condition where you have uh, severe hallucinations, delusions, and paranoia. That sounds wow. fun. Mm -hmm. That Yeah, but he's, like, smoking dabs, like, every single day. Of he said he had to... Mine's going to get messed up. He said he had to quit his job because the voices in his head were too distracting. Whoa. And would even call his friends talking about seeing them. And the friends would be like, uh, we didn't hang out. <laughs> that wasn't me. <laughs> That's when maybe you should like clear up. Like my other buddy, he was smoking a lot. And he said, you know what? I'm going to try to go one year without smoking. And he felt so clear. Really? Yeah, yeah. He felt so clear. His mind was so, he said it was just like a fog lifted. And he just felt like a different person, and he hasn't gone back. What a square. Every once in a <laughs> yeah. while. What a quitter. What a, like, what a boro. Every once in a while. But, uh, yeah, blues it, you know yeah. what I'm saying? I, I feel how. But, like, every once in a while yeah. he'll do it. But like, he didn't realize just how, because like, it was a lot. He was smoking, a, yeah. like, all the time. I feel the opposite, though. I feel like I have a ton of clarity. Menace really? gets clarity. Yeah, yeah, maybe my mind is just too yeah. crazy when it's not high. But uh, experts, He's too smart. Yeah. when it comes to this <laughs> cannabis-induced psychosis, they say it's happening more because uh, THC levels are higher in general these days. Well, if you're at that point, you just start following the band Fish, and um, <laughs> yeah, yep. and that's, that's and your life. Yeah. Call yeah. It a real yeah. cool. Call, call it a life. Call it a life. Yeah. Eight seven seven forty four. What if you're calling in this morning? Hit us up with that text over to two two nine eight seven. So uh, we're gonna have a bunch of different stuff for Menace. We're calling it Speak On It, mm -hmm. where we just uh, give Menace different things. He's been uh, edibling. He's been uh, drinking these weed-infused seltzers. So, uh, we're, I mean, you don't seem that 
You, yeah. don't, you don't seem no, that. He definitely uh, seems no. to me. Just really? Look at Does the, he? his body language. Yeah, it's like because I, he's gone from, like, even just this mm-hmm. morning, he's gone from more of, like, sometimes he's almost falling asleep to now mm-hmm. he seems a little bit more It's alert. a roller coaster ride. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can this, see it in his eyes. Yeah, but I feel like him. it's weird. <laughs> For some reason, I can like ultra hear you right now. Yeah, like yeah. He, can, he can not just hear you. He that can could have something like to do with hearing. Full you. HD quality is weird. That could have something to do with <laughs> the headphones that are on. Did your we head. change these though? No, That's, they sound a lot more no. clear. I, so I don't know. Like, do we do this in this next segment, or do we want to wait until uh, a little bit? You want to let it like? Uh, do you need settle more to kick in, Menace? Drink for speak on it. Yeah, I guess so. Okay, so you, you want to wait for next so, hour? So, yeah. What? Yeah, <laughs> the Raby would like to know if you would like another seltzer. Oh yeah, yeah, I'll do that. Okay, maybe he is right and right. <laughs> I, I don't understand. I will right, we'll do that next. No, okay, perfect. Okay, here on this 420 edition of the Woody Show. Hang on.